Okay, so for the flip-flop cookies, you're going to be needing Nutella, sprinkles, a nutter butters, or any kind of cookies you want, a spoon, and a plastic bag. So you're just going to want to take your bag and just open up your Nutella. You can use icing, you can use basically anything you want, and just go ahead and take your spoon and scoop a little bit of, or more like a lot, into your bag. Okay, so now that your Nutella is in your bag, you just want to take some scissors and go ahead and tip it off like a um, frosting bag and just unwrap your cookies of your choice. Choice. And just take the um, the Nutella and just kind of form like an upside down V, or as you're looking at it, just a regular V, but just an upside down V to make like the flip flop shape. And just take some sprinkles. We're using hearts, you can use flip flops. Anything you want, well not flip flops, because you're doing flip flops. <laughs> um, so just take some hearts and just put them in the middle so they look like little cute flip flops. And you can just make as many as you want and that is your finished flip flop cookies. Okay, so now for your watermelon pops, you're gonna need a blender, a popsicle stick, a cup, whatever of your choice, and of course some watermelon. And now just go ahead and put your watermelon into the bowl thing. No, the blender, well, there. Um, and now just put as much as you want. We just did one popsicle, so we only need a little bit, but if you're gonna do a couple popsicles, make sure you put a little bit more than we did. And when we blended this, we put it on puree, so it would come into the puree thingy, and we had to stick a little spoon in it because it wasn't blending very well. So after that, we just poured it into our cup, and that is your finished watermelon pop. And now you can just freeze it and it would be so delicious. So just put that in the freezer. Uh, make sure you do it for a long time or else it will mess up like ours did. Okay. So now you just wanna take out your thing, put it under some warm water so it can just pop right out and that's what it looks like. And now we are going to be doing the frozen strawberry thing. You're going to be in yogurt, strawberries, a plate, and a spoon, but we used a knife because we didn't have a knife, we didn't have a spoon. So just go ahead and mix up your yogurt of your choice, and you just wanna dip it right, we used Greek yogurt just because it's really nice and we like it like that. So just go ahead and mix it up, and preferably a spoon, but you know, us. Um, so, and then just go ahead, it's really easy, just stick the water, just watermelons. Stick the strawberries into the yogurt and that's basically it and just let it freeze for a while and they are very yummy treats so we just put them in the freezer for maybe like four to five hours and that is it. Okay, so for the outfit, Ella's top is from Aeropostale, her shorts are from Target, and her shoes are from Old Navy. And for Grace's outfit, she's wearing a shirt from Aeropostale, her jean shorts are from Target, and her shoes are Sperry's. We're all bored, we're all so tired of everything.